Okay, let's move to this. All summer long, you'll hear us talk about the importance of sunscreen, right? But what about for your dog? Well, today on Bentley's Corner, Tim Panday just went to Cook Veterinary Medical Center in Chesapeake to find out how to spot and prevent skin cancer in dogs. The sun. Without it, life would not be possible here on Earth. Too much of it, though, can cause some major problems. It's why we protect ourselves from it, lathering up on high SPF sunscreen, sitting under umbrellas, and wearing UV protective clothing. But did you ever think about doing the same thing for your dog? Just as in humans, that sun can be damaging to dog skin and can also cause cancer. So dogs that are affected can be light in color, uh, having a short hair coat, or they may have light color around their, their nose, their eyes, um, their ear margins. They may be dogs that have no hair. Uh, dogs that like to spend a lot of time outside and sunbathe. So how do we prevent this? Sunscreen, of course. There is dog-approved sunscreen available. You would put it on about 20 minutes before the dog going outside. You want to make sure it, it gets absorbed and so the pet's not licking it off. To be clear, you're not rubbing in the sunscreen into the long fur of a dog like Bentley. However, around their nose, ear margins, eyes, places that are not covered by hair is certainly advisable. You may also try UV protection dog clothes. It is always best to catch things early. Spot check your dog for anything unusual. Here's what to look for. So generally speaking, any crust or scale or anything that concerns the owner, I say it's good to have the veterinary take a look at. Especially if it's something, um, some solar damage can look like an ulcer or a crust that doesn't get better. Tim Pandages, 13 News Now.